All right, this is a quick tutorial on how to, once you've imported a QTI uh, file into your course, how to get those questions and put them into a working quiz. So the first thing is we need to make sure that the import um, came through. So in this particular course, um, under settings, um, and then I'm going to go over here to import content into this course, and notice I have a, a complete Chapter 2 QTI that's been completed. So that's what I want. So then I'm going to go ahead and go into my quizzes area to verify that the quiz questions are there. So in the new draft state, you need to click on the gear and choose Manage Question Banks. And from there, it's going to go into your Imported Questions folder. So here are all the questions that I imported. There's 10 of them here. So those are the questions that I want. And so one of the things that you might want to do is go ahead and just rename this particular one to Chapter 2. And then what Canvas will do is automatically create a new import folder with the next one. So what I'm going to do is going to choose Edit Bank Details and call this Chapter 2 or O2 or whatever um, will work for you or CH. Um, oops. And then at the bottom here. Hit enter to uh, commit your changes. Okay, so I have chapter two questions there. So now I'm going to come back to the quizzes area. Okay, and I'm going to create a new quiz. And call this chapter two. Okay. And I won't worry about doing the settings. There's uh, videos on that already out there. But I'll go into the questions. And then I can either, if I want those quest 10 questions to be randomized, I'm going to need to do a question group. So I'll just call this chapter 2. And I want to pick all of them. There's 10 questions, one point a piece. But I'm going to link it to a question bank. So I click that link. There's my chapter 2. Select bank. So questions will be pulled from the bank chapter two, 10 questions. And so now that all the questions are set up, I can then go to save and then click on the preview link here to see how this is going to be displayed to my students. Okay. Save. Preview. Chapter 2 it says there's zero questions. I must not have saved it. Nope. I thought I did. So let's call this Chapter 2. We're going to pick 10. Link to a question. Chapter 2. Select bank. Oh, create group. I didn't commit it. Um, and so now I have my group created. And then I'm going to go ahead and click Save. And then I can go ahead and preview this. Uh, quiz and then there are my 10 questions if I was to refresh this page 10 new questions would be loaded in it would be the same 10 questions but in a different order so that's how you would pull those questions into a quiz um, and then keep editing this quiz if there's some changes like on your settings tab and that kind of thing just don't forget to publish that quiz when you're all done uh, especially with your due dates and available until dates all right that's it thanks